So one of the more interesting things we can do on our iPhone is actually changing our app icons. And doing this is actually very basic. And I'll go and show you a quick demo of how to do it. It's still working on iOS 16. It's probably going to work on iOS 17 as well. So to start off, what you want to do is you want to make sure you have two things on your device to start off with. The application that you want to go ahead and change the app icon to, as well as the shortcuts application. Now the shortcuts app is built into your iPhone. If you deleted it or you don't see it, you can always download it on your iPhone. It's a pretty basic process. Now, when you have those two things, we're going to want a third thing, which is the app icon that you want to go ahead and change to. So in this case, what I usually do is I'll just go ahead and type in something like the name of that app, as well as like aesthetic icon. And usually it'll just go ahead and give me some really decent, you know, images of the app icon that I can go and choose. So you can type it in on Google and find it. In this case, I already have this like right here. So I'll go ahead and download this image down. So I'll save the photos, but you can again, use whichever app icon for whichever application you want to change to. Now, whenever I'm done, I can then make my way back into my shortcuts application. And what I'm going to want to do here is I'm going to want to create a new you know, automation basically. So I'm going to go and click on the plus icon. I'm going to go into shortcuts here and I'm going to go and click on that plus icon right up here. So click on that plus icon. It's going to take you into this next page. And what we're going to want to do is we want to go and hit on this open app option. If you don't see it, you can always search for it as well by clicking add action or searching for it down here. But I'm going to go ahead and click on this open app option. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go and click on the app little button. Now here it's going to allow me to find the application that I basically want to change to. So in this case, what I can do is I can find that application. So in this case, I have Snapchat. I can go and tap on Snapchat and it's going to allow me to basically open up Snapchat. Now we're basically almost done. What we want to do now is we want to click on that share button, which is right down here. So click on share, and then we want to click on add to home screen. So when we do that, we'll basically come into this panel. There's two things we need to do. One, we need to click on the X and we need to write out the name of that application, or you could keep a blank, or you can change the name of the app, whatever you want to do, it doesn't really matter. So in this case, I can go and type in Snapchat. I already messed it up. And then we want to go ahead and tap on that little icon right here, right next to that name. When we do that, it's going to allow us to choose a photo. We want to click choose photo and we want to choose that app icon that we just downloaded earlier. So now we can go and click choose. And now look, if I go and click add on the top right corner, you will see that it will go ahead and add that application right onto my home screen. So now if I go and open it up, you'll see that that little pop-up will come up sometimes kind of annoying, but it will go ahead and change that app icon for me. And that's pretty much all that I have to do. So now I'm going to go and take these into their own page. But that's basically how it's done. You'll see that now we did basically just change out both of these app icons just like that. And that's basically how it's done. It's a super basic process and you can just do this over and over again with all the other apps that you have. And that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.